Hey guys, how's everybody doing today? Autographs 2000 here. And in today's video, I've got five autographs through the mail, TTMs. And I'm also gonna show some in-person autographs that I got uh, yesterday. First things first, we're gonna show some TTMs. And the first one is from Cleveland, Ohio. And we have Mike Birkbeck. He signed five of five in 142 days. He had a career record of 12 and 19 with a 4.86 ERA. He played six years, appeared in 54 games. He played from 86 to 89, and then 92, and then 95. And during his career, he played with Milwaukee and the Mets. There's Mr. Mike Birkbeck. All right, our second return is from Phoenix, Arizona. And we have David Segui. He signed three of three in 26 days. He had a career batting average of 291, 139 RBI, home runs, 684 RBIs. He played 15 years. He appeared in 1,456 games. He played from 90 to 04. And he played with the Orioles, Mets, Expos, Mariners, Blue Jays, Rangers, and Indians. His best year was in 2000 with the Texas Rangers and Cleveland. And in that year, he hit 19 home runs, drove in 103, and batted 334. That was a monster year for Mr. David Segui. Our next return is from Boston, Massachusetts. And we've got a mascot. We have got Wally the Green Monster. He signed two of two in nine days. And he made his debut in 1997. That is Wally the Green Monster. Gotta love those mascot TTMs. Wally the Green Monster. All right, next we're going to show, I'm going to show you the in-person autographs I got. It was at the Down East Wood Ducks game. They were playing the Kannapolis Cannonballers, which is an affiliate of the Chicago White Sox. And I got about 15 cards signed, and here's who I got. You got James Beard. Get him again. We have Guillermo Quiros, who is a coach for the Cannonballers. We have Cam Cawley, Jared Kelly, Wes Kath, who is the number six prospect for the White Sox. We have Benjamin Bailey. He signed four. We have Gilder Rodriguez, who is a coach for the Wood Ducks. He signed two. We got Dylan McLean, relief pitcher for the Wood Ducks. He signed three, and that is it. It's not a bad haul. Again, it was the Wood Ducks and the Kannapolis Cannonballers, single-A affiliate of the Texas Rangers and Chicago White Sox. All right, our next return is from Dallas, Texas. And we have Bobby Witt. He signed five of six in 21 days. He had a career record of 142 and 157 with a 4.83 ERA. He played 16 years, appeared in 430 games. He played from 86 to 01. And he played with Rangers, A's, Marlins, Cardinals, Rays, Indians, and Diamondbacks. He won a World Series in 01 with the Diamondbacks. I do not know why he didn't sign that card. And during his career, he threw very hard, but he had a lot of control issue, control problems. And when he was with the Rangers, the fans there used to call him Wit and Wild. <laughs> Wit and Wild. Because he, I believe he led the league in walks three times. Led the league in wild pitches a couple more times. 
And again, that's Bobby Witt. And our final return is a big one. It is from Miami, Florida. And we've got Larry Walker. He signed one of two in 355 days. He had a career batting average of 313, 383 home runs, 1,311 RBIs. He played 17 years. He played with Montreal, Colorado, and St. Louis. He played from 89 to 05. He was a five-time All-Star. He was the National League MVP in 1997. And in that year, he hit 49 home runs, drove in 130, and he batted 366 with 33 stolen bases. That is a monster, monster season. Um, he's also a seven-time gold glover, three-time batting champ. He was inducted to the Major League Baseball Hall of Fame in 2020. And he became the first player in over 60 years to bat 360 or better in three consecutive years. And that was in 97, 98, and 99, where he batted 366, 363, and 379. And he's also the first player to be inducted in the Hall of Fame from the to wear a Rockies hat. So, and the Rockies also retired his number. So he was a huge, huge player for the Rockies. And he is in the Hall of Fame 2020, as he inscribed on the card. And that, guys, is going to do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please smash that like button. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. And until next time, guys, Autographs 2000 is out.